Welcome to the Numerology and Astrology for April 25th, 2022. If you add all those numbers together, you get the number 17, and if you add the 1 and the 7 together, you get the number 8. The number 8 is the number of grief, loss, and sadness, and it can allow us to let go of a trauma from our past and embrace a deeper potential within. Sometimes situations demand us to express our emotional depth in order to tell the truth, not just to others, but to ourselves also. All souls have moments when they struggle to be seen and loved. Problems in our past create obstacle courses that others have to work their way through in order for them to prove that they care. And that is unfair. Too often we create very demanding and difficult circumstances that take too much effort and do not give a result that offers any real value in the end. That is why we have to learn to take down the walls, the traps, and the double blind tests to make others conform to our standards instead of discovering how to be open, authentic, and above all, kind. When we hide sadness from ourselves, we create lots of closed places within that do not allow others the knowing to be able to access those most valuable parts and places. Unresolved inner pain is often hidden from view and it festers in silence. When we want the world to change, what is often the case is that we need to change in how we interrelate with the world. Notice where we might be using anger and pain to avoid the deeper sadness, grief, or weakness. Always look underneath the emotion that is currently your dominant expression. Breathe love and light into that place and notice what opens and what might be just beyond that dragon guarding the gate. And my astrology for today. The moon will shift this morning from Aquarius and into the very sensitive place of Pisces. We are being asked to seek wisdom in those deep and dark places where all things of value try to hide, waiting for the right moment to emerge. Much has happened during this Aquarius moon, and because of that extra energy, we drew a line in places that became important for us and for our growth. Now the Pisces moon is a soothing balm on those places that we're feeling raw and too real. Take a moment to think through what just happened and perhaps begin to understand why that moment was necessary. Under the Pisces moon, there will be much more awareness unfolding and we are learning to take in what is offered with kind hands and open hearts. Mars will align with the moon tonight and that adds more juice to our creative side and allows our intuition to be heightened. Inspiration comes from gaining clarity around our personal motivations and the actions that are upcoming and necessary. The North Node and Venus will sextile bringing more cooperation into all activities and show us that sometimes growth comes from defining our boundaries. That allows us to live our life rather than live the lives that others demand. Thanks, everyone.